Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's me, Apple Chapel, a welcome. Hi. So in today's video, I'm going to try Prime Wardrobe. I know I've done that before with athletic wear. I'll link it here or down below in the info box. But I just saw some shoes that I really, really wanted to try and see if they look good on me. And I really tried to find them somewhere else, but I couldn't find them anywhere else. And then I was like, okay, maybe they don't even look good on me. I just wanted to try. So I ordered some Prime Wardrobe items. The maximum you can actually order, so you can order up to six items for free. You can try them on for seven days, and then on the seventh day, if you did not decide to send them back or pay for some items that you want to keep, they will take the whole money the order would have cost. So today's the seventh day, and I actually have to finish a term paper, but since I don't have the money for all of the items, I really have to do this video now. If I somehow appear stressed, it's because I am. <laughs> Did I explain everything with Prime Wardrobe? Yeah, so at the moment it cost me zero and I ordered some items that are kind of fitting for the fall and I know I'm dressing as if it's summer, like a summer night or something. It's because I already missed summer and it doesn't feel like we had a nice summer, you know, with everything going on. But I thought I'd just dress up today make myself feel better. I even put on earrings again. I haven't done that since March when everything started. So, feels good to be back. Feels good to be dressed up. Let's just dive right in. This is my order without the shoes inside. So it came in a bag. Let's start. Let's start with the scarf. They even sent the thing where it hangs. It's the same, nearly the same color. Okay, I'm already sweating. <laughs> it's for children. Oh yeah, it's sort of small. But the only scarf I really use is like a really big scarf. And I love the color. Oh, and I actually li like that it's so small. Mm. I gotta see it with my winter jacket on. And this is my winter jacket. Well, it actually belonged to my sister, but I just snatched it. And never gave it back. Oh, and I think the zipper was broken at some point and we had to replace it. If it's not too cold, I'll just wear it like this without a scarf. I think I like this one. Hmm. Next up. So I have a lot of turtlenecks because I feel like since my face is so round and somehow I have a thick neck, <laughs> I never really like turtlenecks that much. I have this one zip jacket that I don't really like. I bought it 10 years ago and I barely wore it because I felt really manly in it. But now that I started to go to the gym, I can actually wear it. And I love it because it keeps your neck warm. Even after workouts, it's very important that you keep warm. Just take care, everyone. Okay, so we have a white turtleneck from Esprit. Oh, <laughs> from S. Oliver, size 36. It's rather see-through, but I wanted to have like a white turtleneck, despite the fact that this is see-through. <laughs> it's not too bad. I kind of look like an art student. Do I? Next up, we have a black turtleneck from S. Oliver. Wait, it's dark blue. Okay. <laughs> what? Yeah, um, what's there to say? It's boring in comparison to the other one, but if it keeps warm and looks good, it'll be good. Okay, I gotta say I don't like the blue. The dark turtleneck doesn't really work for me. It doesn't really work well with my aesthetic, but what do you think? I I feel like I look very strict. Nope. Even though this is like the same brand and the other one was size 36, this is supposed to be 38. The sleeves are very short. This one is bigger than the white turtleneck. And that is just crazy because it feels smaller. So don't be sad if you don't fit into a smaller size. Even in one brand, they just don't know what they're doing. <laughs> I don't know how this happens, but this is so much smaller than the other one, and the other one was a size smaller. But I didn't even notice that all of those turtlenecks were from S. Oliver. Okay, now it's a combination of the two turtlenecks from before. Oh, I think I'm definitely going to keep this. I, I like this. So far, this is actually like a sweater. It's like a real sweater. The others feel very thin, but this one feels like you can actually wear it without anything on top and if you like pair it with an oversized t-shirt so eat girl hmm. let's put it on <laughs> okay i i don't know why 
but for some reason I didn't even notice. I thought it was just like an oversized fit, but this is size 44. What the hell was I thinking? Yeah, I guess I thought it might look cute having an oversized turtleneck, so... I wanted to have a messy bun. Before I started the video, I was like, oh, I want to do a messy bun, but I can never do it. My hair is too straight. Now it's a messy bun. <laughs> Even though this is size 44. Oh, I, I kind of like it. And see the shoulders? It's just like a bit bigger than the other ones. Okay, actually, I think I like it. Yes. <laughs> and it's also long. I like when tops are long, especially in fall or winter. The size is so wrong, but I think I'm going to keep this just because it feels so comfy. I mean, it's like, <laughs> it's eight. No, is it eight sizes? It must be four sizes. 36 is my usual size. It's five sizes too big. That is only five sizes? What? I mean, it's probably supposed to be tight, but I just love it this way. I'm keeping this. <gasps> oh, yeah. I'm so excited about this one. Okay, the sticker looks kind of wrecked, so I think someone already put it on, maybe. Who knows? It's prime wardrobe. Oh my goodness. So this is a super dry skirt, and I really want to know how this looks like. I am in love with maxi skirts. And I want to see if it looks good on me. Here we are. I remember this price because it's ridiculously expensive. 95 euros or something from Superdry. Why is it so wide? And see-through. If you make something as expensive, why do you make it see-through? The fabric is actually really thick. You could have made it better. Like, look at this. What? Anyways, I'm so excited to try this on. I can't wait. I can't wait. I'm stressed. I am stressed. I don't know how to show this. I'll try to tilt the camera. I gotta say, I love the look. Obviously, I'm not going to pay 90 euros, but you can see this is like the undergarment kind of until here. And then the flares, it's just like see-through. And this is perfect. Like I have a fabric like this. I'm going to blend in a picture and what the, what is this? Okay, next one. I already removed the lid because I'm stressed and I just want to finish the video. I'm so sorry. I know the videos that I enjoy making, I enjoy making this, don't get me wrong. But I just really need to finish this. I don't want to send the vibes because I know the videos that you really, 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 really enjoy making are just the best. It shows. Like my first ever video, everyone likes it. Thank you so much. Okay, stop talking because I'm, I, just, I, I just need to continue. Georgs. Kids. Okay, I know I have two items that are for children. Hear me out. This scarf actually looked pretty good and it doesn't look like it is specifically for children. I was scared about these and I have to admit I already put them on because I couldn't wait. Here they are. Oh no, can you see my messy room now? Damn it. And they're size 39. And actually, I have always have 38. The problem with me is I have very wide feet. Sometimes shoes don't fit because they're too narrow. And then I thought, okay, but kids' shoes, they probably are more narrow because they're made for children. Children usually don't have like very big feet. This is a size 39 as well, but immediately when I took them out of the box, I was like, holy, they are so, so big. Okay, I gotta say, this one might be a bit too childish for me. Like, depending on the outfit, I have to check. And I really like the style. It's like see through sock with some fringes. So this one is kind of like, I'd say playful too, but it's fine because it has like more than mature. What's this called? Anyways, I like them, but they're too big. So I need a size smaller. Summary, I really think I'm going to keep this, which is actually not my size, and the scarf. And I'm going to do a DIY recreating the skirt I tried on. And the shoes, my plan is to get the shoes I tried on in a size smaller, but in spring. Hopefully I will still like them, if not, I saved money. <laughs> but my plan is to get some really, really nice boots next month because winter is coming and I bought some really nice boots last summer and I love them and I wear them every day when it's cold but then I could use a second pair to wear every day that looks a bit more fancy anyways it's too hot okay I want to do this in the outro but I can't I'm very surprised this weather actually smells good for something that is new okay <laughs> Thank you all for watching everyone. I hope you enjoyed it. I did. I hope I wasn't too stressed out. If you want to see more, please support the channel. I also have Instagram, Twitter, Twitch, TikTok. 
uh, there are so many. If you want to see anything, make sure to drop a follow there as well. And yeah, I do gaming content on Twitch. And here, I don't know where we're going. I'll just do whatever I feel like doing and maybe I will find a niche. But so far, <laughs> my YouTube channel is um, very diverse. The best you can do, you can vote for content you want to see in the future, like what you prefer. I know what most of you want to see. The My Hero Academia haul is the most popular one. And I, yeah, it was really fun to do that. Yes, I see you and I'm going to do more anime content for everyone. You can vote for the content you want to see by interacting with said video from said topic. I'd say, as long as you're fine with everything, I will do everything that I enjoy. So, yes, that's it. Did I say everything? Thank you for watching, stay safe, and don't procrastinate, please. If you see this, start working now, what I will do as well. See you next time, bye-bye.